An SUV that rolled into the Winooski River this morning is out of the water tonight. Now, no one was hurt, but as ABC 22's Sam Israel shows us, a simple mistake created quite the scene. On Wednesday morning, a car in the Pangala parking lot rolled off into the Winooski River. It then floated downstream about 100 yards before ending by the bridge. After nearly six hours of being submerged in the Winooski River, an SUV at last lifted up onto the Winooski Street Bridge. Definitely a spectacle to see, and uh, we were really curious to see how it would happen. And, you know, it was impressive to, to see them do it super safe. It's great to be done. It's, it's a relief. Uh, you know, today's a beautiful day and the current's not bad. I spoke to the driver, but they didn't want to go on camera. They did say they forgot to put their vehicle in park. They didn't realize until it was too late, as they helplessly watched their Honda CRV roll into the river. The parking bumpers couldn't stop it from going in. Car parts could also be seen in the river. Just the top of the roof was visible after the vehicle settled to the bottom. Fortunately, no one was inside. That's when divers like Mike Hendrickson were called to the scene. When you do this kind of thing, first thing we're thinking, safety. Get in the water, we've got a shore support person with tag lines, and we've got uh, lines attached to the vehicle. We've had Burlington Fire on scene, and those guys had people ready to be in the water. Those in the community gathered to see the rare sight. Saw a group of people looking into the river, so we were like, what's going on? And we came out with our morning coffee, and lo and behold, there was a car in the river. We've seen kayakers, but no cars. Never a car. Never. One first time. I just wanted to see, like, in person. Some who regularly go to the Pingala parking lot avoid the spots nearby the river. It, it really <laughs> is weird that there's a parking spot right next to the river but yeah that parking lot has always sketched me out because it is like a very steep incline right after pretty low tire bumpers um and it's right there next to the river the restaurant owners didn't want to speak on camera but did say they've heard concerns from customers about the lack of guardrails along the river one of the owners even admitted to avoiding parking in that area in the past the agency of natural resources was notified but there were no environmental hazards in Burlington, Sam Israel, ABC 22 News.